Hello guys, it is about to be 9 in the morning. I've been up since 5.30 and literally could not go back to sleep. And I went to sleep last night, like around 1.30 in the morning. <laughs> so, four hours of sleep, my eyes hurt, like they, they feel like they're burning. Um, but I literally could not go back to sleep. I even took a sleeping gummy right now in the morning because I was like, you know what? I, I need to sleep, I need to get some rest. And I couldn't, I just couldn't fall back asleep. So I finally decided to get up. Today is LRD concert tickets day. So crossing my fingers, I, I have my alarm set. They go on till like 12 p.m. <laughs> so me and my sister are both going to try to get them. And then we'll see who gets them first. Like who's able to get through. Because I'm sure it's going to be crazy. But if you got some already, lucky you. <laughs> um, Yeah, I'm just going to start my day. Because like I said, I can't go back to sleep. So I'm just over it. I'll try to nap later, or I'll just take, like, three sleeping gummies, like, at 6 or 7 p.m. to go to sleep early, because... Mm. The way my head is hurting. I'm wearing the same PJs, by the way. Um, I always wear my PJs twice. <laughs> is that weird? Uh, but I also was too lazy to shower <laughs> yesterday, so I didn't shower. I don't care. <laughs> um, I literally wish... Nothing more than to have gotten more sleep because I hate when I feel like this. Like, I literally feel so tired. Like, my eyes literally hurt so bad. Like, they burn. I also don't feel like cleaning, cleaning today. So, I don't care. I'm not going to clean. Like, I'm going to, like, wash the dishes and stuff. But I'm not going to, like, clean up the room and stuff. I just, I don't feel like it today. <laughs> as soon as I woke up at 5.30, I... I already woke up with that, like, I don't know, with that mindset that I just, I felt, like, really drained. So, I was like, I'm not going to clean today. So, there's that. Um, but what we are going to do is drink some coffee. The most important meal of the day, serving it up, get it least with Yes. I'm going to YOLO it today and use creamer that's not sugar free this is just a coconut one from coffee mate i love this creamer i use it literally every single day um but obviously it has sugar in it <laughs> um it has five grams so it's not too bad i guess um i've had this for forever <laughs> i've had this literally since last year last year was only like a month ago but it's it expires until april 3rd 13 2023 so i'm gonna use it see see how it works <laughs> I want to make sure it works before I pour it in my coffee because I'm like, what if it doesn't work and then I ruin my coffee? So, I'm going to pour a tiny bit right here. Mm. Oh my god, that tastes so good. Well, I guess I should put that one. Uh-uh, that tastes delicious. Oh my god. Yes. <laughs> mm -hmm. my mom gave me these they're from mexico but i don't know if they're like sweet cookies or like healthy cookies they're um galletas integrales so they're how do you say that in english um wheat cookies i think oh no i think they're like salty yeah not salty but like they're not sweet <laughs> like savory i guess yeah they're like not sweet <laughs> not for coffee i think i'm gonna come to my room <laughs> and do my makeup i'm just gonna do like um like glam again but i'm gonna do it for instagram stories because i oops i filmed it on the vlog a lot so i'm back besties i just finished filming this little valentine's look for my um instagram stories so if you guys don't follow me follow me on instagram it'll be somewhere on the screen here um i really liked how it turned out i never do color on my eyes but today i really wanted to do pink I was inspired by like Valentine's Day, so this is the look. I'll show you guys a quick little close-up. I think it's so pretty. Okay, um, I'm gonna clean up because I have a mess now. I'm not gonna make my bed or anything, but I'm gonna clean up all the 
the makeup and everything that I do on the bed and stuff. So we'll do that. And then, I don't know. I guess just wait for the, the tickets, you guys. It is 11.16. <gasps> okay. So I got the Erebida tickets for me and my sisters. Um, and I just kept clicking any section, any seats. Like, I didn't care. I just wanted tickets, right? Everything was sold out. So I was like, oh, like I thought I was like, this is it. It's over. They're sold out. We didn't get any. And then in the bottom, it said, so those, there was like a regular section for tickets and then a side view seating section, side view. So I clicked it and it let me get tickets for that. So I, I got what I could. I was like, whatever. I don't care. So, I, but okay. So I don't, I didn't know where this section is, right? I just Googled the MGM Grand Garden Arena um, map to see where we're sitting. We're literally all the way on top, like literally all the way on top. It's literally like, so it's like the stage right here. And we are all the way on top over here on the side, like all the way on top though, like the last top row. Which again, I don't care because I just wanted to be there. I don't care. But my tickets were so expensive. Not like so expensive, but they were literally so expen expensive compared to the rest of the top tickets that are not side view, that are just the regular ones that are all, all the way on top. Those were regular, like 60 something dollars. I paid a lot more than 60 something dollars for those tickets each. We paid, me and my sister. And I'm so confused. I cannot comprehend why are they so much more expensive. When you have a side view like that, it's not... Shouldn't it be cheaper because you're like something could be in the way of you fully seeing the full stage because it's like on, right on the side. So like your vision can be compromised there, but, like on something like, I don't know, just based on like a big um, screen that's in the way or like the sound might not be the best of it, whatever. So I'm so confused. Why were they so expensive? And, and they were not resale tickets. Okay. They were literally like original tickets that they were selling. So can someone explain to me if anybody knows why were they so expensive? Now I'm like upset and I told my sister, I'm like, we're going to resell those tickets because I'm so upset, but I want to be there no matter what, but I'm just so mad that they were literally so expensive when other people got them for 60 something dollars for that same level. I had to turn on my heater because I was literally freezing, you guys. Freezing. I still haven't showered because I'm still trying to decide if I'm going to work out today. I didn't work out yesterday, so I'm like, I really should, but I'm lazy. Um... I don't know, I just threw it like that. I just have some cotton puffs that I was going to use to put some toner in my face before I did my makeup and I completely forgot. Um, anyways, I'm going to get my bag ready for work because it's Friday and I go back to work on Monday. Love that for me. Um, I'm excited, but like I'm not excited because I work retail, so there's nothing to be excited about. <laughs> I, mm, I'm thankful to have a job, but um, I'm excited mostly to catch up with my coworkers and my friends from work, so... That's the only thing that I'm really excited about. And to start getting paychecks again because I haven't gotten a paycheck in like three months. So that's going to be good. Because <laughs> I've been just spending money from like my savings account, like credit card. Um, so yeah, excited for that. But I'm excited to go back. But anyways, I'm going to get my bag ready. So I have to take clear bags like I've mentioned before. I bought this tote from Shein. Um, I also bought this really cute little bag. It's so little just for like my wallet, my deodorant, my headache relief um pills but i'm gonna take this one because i like how big this one is and i can take my lunch in here and i don't have to take a separate bag for my lunch and it comes with this little pouch that i'm gonna put all my essentials so like a pad a liner um i'm gonna take like a lotion um my store keys oh, so weird i'm not it's literally been so long three months so weird okay let me get um a pad and a liner to put in this so here we have necessities so i'm just putting two pads in here and one liner i like to have more than one pad in case somebody asks me for one and i still like to have one on hand because what if i get my period i'm gonna put obviously my store keys in here oh, feels so weird um lotion and perfume as always so i have this lotion from victoria's secret and then i also have this does it even have it has a little bit left um the bombshell beach from victoria's secret I like to carry perfume, deodorant, and lotion because I've forgotten to put on all those things way too many times. So, 
The rest of this is literally just a mess. I have, why do I have a bunch of quarters? Literally a bunch of quarters, like $2 worth in quarters in here. Girl, that's Starbucks money. <laughs> um, oh my God, I have so many coins. I don't know why. I have a lash glue. Does it even have some? I forgot I left these things in here. No, it's like sticky weird. I have, an, I have like three new lash glue, so I don't need that. <gasps> I forgot my Shein liner is in here, and I love that liner. <gasps> this NARS, has this been here the whole time? Am I sure? I thought I saw it over here. I guess not. Um, I guess, is that it? What else do I put in my bag? Obviously, my wallet with keys my deodorant, my Tylenol, but I have that in my regular purse that I wear right now for like um, just any anytime I go out, which is this one from Shein. So I'm gonna transfer that over here once, literally right on Sunday, if hopefully I don't forget, but, cause I'm still using that purse, so I still carry my essentials over there. But I think, oh my God, why do I have so many quarters, you guys? That's it, huh? I need to go return stuff from Ulta and some jeans from walmart i should probably do that today or tomorrow maybe i don't know and i also want to go get i think they sell rollers like hair rollers the really cheap ones at dollar tree because that is the key to volume you guys today i don't know i have a picture i'll try to put it right here somewhere i did this look on instagram today and like this makeup look and i did my hair before and it has you can't really tell anymore but it has a lot more volume than I usually do. Like it looks, my hair looks just fluffier and like nicer today, because I, the top curls like this layer up here, I clipped them. So when I, when I when I came out of the curling iron, I grabbed it in my hand and I clipped it with this little clip that I had, and when I let them down, it looked a lot more voluminous and like, it just had a lot more volume. I liked it. So I want to go get rollers, so my hair can look nice and bouncy and flowy like if i got got it done at a salon so yeah maybe today maybe tomorrow on sunday i kind of just want to chill and relax that's my last official day to like really relax <laughs> obviously i have days off for work but you know what i mean ah! yeah i'm still mad about those rbd tickets they were so expensive and they're literally all the way on top guys i have a dress on Ooh, i have a dress on because i'm trying on the faja from Shein that I got and I wanted to make sure that it looks good and like to see how my dresses look on me still because I'm so fat I'm still very insecure about my body so don't judge me please but um the faja works good I thought it was not gonna fit me it looks tiny look how I still have like a belly obviously but look how snatched I look look at this obviously I have something but it really pulls you in right here I think I look decent, like, it's fine, like, I'm, look, I don't think it looks that bad, little mama, mom pouch right here, but I think it looks okay, and I think I'm willing to wear dresses to work. Yes! I'm gonna use this to take off my makeup because it's bothering me, like, my lashes and stuff, so let me go with this and I will be right back. I feel like I don't even want to get this dirty because it's so cute. Oh my god. It's a little. That's not going to be enough for all this glam. I don't even want to take off my makeup because I really like how it came out. But my eyes feel like droopy. <laughs> yeah, my eyes feel so heavy right now because I got like no sleep. <sighs> Man, the eyelashes really make the whole look. <laughs> We're going to remove. So essentially, this is just, um, what do you call this? What do you call those makeup removing cloth thingies? Um, what is that brand? Oh my god, makeup eraser. There we go. Makeup eraser, basically. Oops. If we're gonna take off uh, the eye makeup. I don't think. This is going to be enough for my whole face, so I guess we'll just take off the eye makeup and we'll go from there. I honestly only got this because it's so cute. I literally got it because it's cute. It was $4 though. It's so tiny. So tiny. 
I don't think it's worth it if you, it's still cheap, but I don't think it's worth it if you put on like a full face of glam like I always do. Um, if you, somebody like my little sister, she usually only does like her brows and her eye makeup. Um, that would be beneficial to somebody like her because she can take off all her makeup with that little, is there another wipe in there? I have two more of these. These are my favorite wipes, by the way. Simple. Um, she can take off her whole makeup with just the little cleansing cloud, but... For someone like me that needs to take off literally my entire face makeup and everything, no. It's a no for me. I think the eyeshadow stained my eyelids. <laughs> the eyeshadow definitely stained my lids. Look at that. I I rubbed and rubbed already and it's just stained. Okay, I'm enjoying a coffee that I made here and a cookie. Very delish. Um, I'm gonna dye my hair again, black again. The last time I dyed it was in, when did I, I just dyed it, right? December. Yes, so it's been like a month. It's still, my hair, I know my hair is still black, but you can tell, well, I can tell that it's starting to like fade up here and looks a little bit more brown. To, to some of you guys, you guys might be like, oh my God, your hair looks so black. What are you talking about? But I can tell for me, and I want it to look super black for when I go back to work, so I'm going to dye it on Sunday. But I'm only going to get one box of hair dye instead of two this time. I have so much hair, I know that, and it's so long. But since it's already black for the most part, and I kind of just want to touch it up a little bit, I'm just going to get one box. That should be plenty. And I need to go get rollers so bad, you guys, because look at how much volume my hair got today. Like, I love. Um, I'm still thinking of whether I'm gonna work out or not. <laughs> I need to shower for sure. I'm so lazy today, it's just one of those days. Clearly it's one of those days. I'm just going crazy today. Eating pretty much whatever, I'm having a cookie. I haven't even been in it, but. It's just one of those days and it's okay to have those days. It's okay. I've been pretty good and like disciplined with myself, so. Except for last weekend. Last weekend, I ate a lot. <laughs> I ate a lot. Um, and you know what I think? Subconsciously, I was thinking about this. Last Saturday was um, baby Erin's two-month anniversary. So, I think that's why... Um, that day, I just felt, obviously, really... I knew that it was that day, so I felt really down. And then I was just eating a lot. Like my sister got McDonald's that day in the morning and I was like, you know what? I want some too. And then later my my dad got Panda for himself and my mom and sister. And I was like, you know what? I'll get some too. <laughs> um, so I think I was just binge eating subconsciously without really like paying attention, if that makes sense. Because it was like a really sad day for me. And I just ate that Saturday and Sunday too. So I was like, whatever. Today, I haven't ate like bad, bad. I had like eggs in the morning, huevo con chorizo in the morning with some beans, which is, I mean, it's not the healthiest at all by any means, but it's not like crazy. That's all I had for breakfast. I didn't even finish it. Um, I had a tortilla and another piece of a tortilla, literally like little tortillas. <laughs> That's literally all I've ate. And then I'm having a nice coffee and a cookie. So, YOLO. It's the next day, but I forgot to end the vlog as always. So <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Um, and I am going to try to do a giveaway at 500 subscribers, you guys. So make sure you let your friends know to subscribe. Share my channel with them. Share share my channel with whoever you can, please. It would mean the world to me. And thank you for those of you who support me and watch me. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed it. Give it a thumbs up. Subscribe before you leave. And I will see you guys in my next one. Bye.